Hey everyone, and welcome to the 2016 Rockford Fosgate Product Showcase. We're coming to you from the Hard Rock Hotel in Las Vegas, Nevada, where we're basically displaying some of the hottest new products that Rockford is showing for 2016. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take you and give you an inside look at some of those new products and what you can expect coming down the pipe from Rockford Fosgate for 2016. So let's go inside and see what we've got. Hey everyone, I'm here with Mark Lowe from RTTI and he and I are going to talk about our brand new sound lab. So Mark, let me ask you first. Several years ago we built our mini sound labs and they've been on the road, they've been around the country and so forth, but this year we decided to build a new one. So really, what was the concept of why we wanted to build this new lab? Really with the new one we wanted to showcase some of the new power product. The previous mini sound labs were all about punch product. Okay. Uh, we had new punch amps, new punch woofers, so it was all about punch. This is all about power and all about the best of the best of the products that Rockford offers. Okay, so kind of walk me through what was some of the basic components that we put into this system to really build this van up? Well, we wanted to start with the biggest, baddest thing that Rockford makes, and that's the new T3 19-inch subwoofers. Cool. Okay, so I can see we've got obviously four of these and a big ported enclosure. Um, now, what do we got as far as a powerhouse? to drive these things, because they, they do need quite a bit of power. Yes, they do, Rico. So we decided to go with the biggest amp that Rockford makes, the 2500. So we put a 2500 on each woofer. Oh, wow. So four okay. of them. So we're driving easily 2500 to possibly 3000 watts to every woofer. Um, so we've got those wired, big ported enclosure. Um, what were some of the, the design elements, the unique things that you decided to do with this one that we haven't done in the past with some of the other bands? You know, we really tried to learn from the other vans, and we take those to a lot of events, and I like to hear the input that we get from the consumers and from the people working the vehicles. And one of the main things that everyone always wanted to know is, what are the people doing inside? What do they look like when they're going through this demo? Sure. So we wanted to add an outside monitor so everyone could see what's happening on the inside. Okay. So that was one of the main things. The other thing that we get asked all the time is, how many shows does this thing do? How many times do you do demos? And then the big question is, how many people... Punch out? Okay, yeah, I'll leave it at that. How many people <laughs> panic out? We're, we call them other things like that, but... so Of course. So to keep track of that, we added meters down here, and this tells us RF fanatics and then punched out. So we have an ongoing count from the day that this vehicle was built, and we'll know the entire time. So we can always keep track, and then everybody can see easily how many people kind of wimped out, so to speak, and had to punch out. Had, so. had, to, had to hit the big red button. All right. Well, that's really cool. Now, obviously, designing and developing a vehicle such as this, especially with everything that went into it, what kind of challenges did you guys come up with? Because obviously there were some when we built the original punch version. Really the biggest challenge with this is, obviously it's a small van. So going to 19s, we have a lot of surface area and we, we didn't have a very big baffle to put all those woofers on. And of course we wanted to go with a high efficient vented enclosure. So to get enough vent area within that baffle area that we had to put the woofers and the vent, that was probably the biggest challenge. Okay, okay. All right. Well, that's very cool. Well, I thank you for taking the time out of your busy day to kind of walk us through that. And that pretty much wraps it up for us here at the 2016 uh, Rock for Fosgate Electronic Showcase. And see you later.